Hi. I've seen a lot of skeptics who say that Hackintoshes crash all the time or that they just don't work very well. Well, this video will show you otherwise. This is my Hackintosh. That's right, a PC with Mac OS X installed on it. And I'm going to show you exactly what it can do. All right, let's get started. I'll show you what my Snow Leopard Hackintosh can do. We'll start with about this Mac. Let's zoom in. You'll see it's Mac OS X, version 10.6.1. Zoom out. And let's start with some videos with QuickTime X. I'm going to start 12 videos here. I may have missed one there. But that's okay. And let's drag a few over to the second monitor. Notice I'm running in dual monitor mode. All right. And let's use Expose to watch all 12 videos. That looks great. Using Expose, I can watch all 12 videos at once. Okay, let's close that out. Quit. And let's see if we can run HD video off of YouTube. Here's one of my earlier videos. Full screen, play. All right, it looks great, running in full HD. All right, let's close that out. Let's see if we can run a 3D game. World of Warcraft. <clears throat> okay. And I signed up for a private server since I no longer subscribe to the game. But let's enter in and see how it works. Let's see how OpenGL runs on this machine. Okay, we've loaded up. Let's check our frames per second. We have 49 right there, 46. And let's check the settings. We're at 1920 by 1080, and the effects are almost all set to the absolute highest possible. And we're running very smooth with vertical sync turned on. And I played World of Warcraft extensively on this machine. It works great. Let's jump. Here we go. And I died. So World of Warcraft works great. Here we are. You can see that OpenGL games on Mac OS X on a Hackintosh work very well. Let's exit out. Let's do one more thing. Let's open up Final Cut Pro because I know a lot of you power users are using Final Cut Pro. You'll notice a little fuzzy box or whatnot here to block out my serial number. That's added just so that you can't see my serial number. And Final Cut Pro is loaded up. Here's my previous video, the quick Hackintosh tutorial in HD. Let's see if we can go ahead and put that on the second monitor. Wait for it to load. And there we go. It's on the second monitor. Let's scrub through. There we go. Scrubbing with audio of HD video and Final Cut Pro. And the video you're watching right now was edited in output using Final Cut Pro and compressor. All right, that's my Hackintosh. So those of you skeptics out there, this is what it can do. It can do everything a normal Hackintosh can do once it's booted up. Everything after loading the operating system is available to you.